few days to go before the BRICS summit, Trade and Industry Minister Ibrahim Patel. You'll see a number of products. You'll see cars and taxis and buses and three-wheelers that are made here on the African continent. You'll see here also not only a showcase of South African industrial capability, but also of 19 other African countries. The BRICS um, allows for us to tap into different spaces that we usually wouldn't be um, open to. We're able to meet people from different backgrounds, with different ideas. This opportunity that has been given for networking, we hope you know African countries can partner and work together for sustainable growth. As a company that is in the area of deploying Wi-Fi to underprivileged communities, um, equipment for me is a big one. So uh, I'm attending one of the sessions where Huawei um, is speaking because we, are, we know we have to find cheaper ways of production to ensure that um, we reduce our costs and um, so that we can roll out to as many communities as possible. I think the opportunities for growth, opportunities for both women, but also the le lessons coming from the COVID-19 that, you know, there are, there's a different way and different shift to grow each other's economies and take advantage of what we each bring to the party.